UMass Boston softball down in Myrtle Beach for their first game of their spring break trip on Saturday morning against the University of Scranton and UMass Boston early on in some trouble. Bree Melchionda loads the bases on walks, gets a big strikeout for the first out. Sol Dooner is going to hit an RBI ground out to first base. Toomey over there dives on the bag to get the second out, and then Melchionda comes back with a strikeout. So after walking four, she strikes out two of her last four batters to get out of the jam. Lauren Miner, welcome to the collegiate level. Her first collegiate hit, a home run to dead center field, gives the Beacons a 2-1 to one lead in the second inning. However, the Royals would not be done. They would come back to tie the game up at two all in the third inning as Alyssa Moscone would have an RBI ground out to short. The Beacons wouldn't allow a hit through the first two and two thirds innings until after that point, two hits would be recorded for the Royals over the next two innings. But Amari English with an RBI triple in the fourth inning gives the Beacons the lead back three to two as you see English Going all the way around second, motoring the third, standing up. Beacons back in front. And then Lauren Miner, her debut continues to be star-studded. An RBI triple into the corner. It almost looked like it was going to get out. It doesn't, but that's going to score a run. And the Beacons now are up 4-2 to two in the fourth inning. Once again, though, they continue to fight back as Bree Malkianda is going to get this force out there at first base on the ground out. Beacon stay ahead 4-2. to two. Lauren Miner then is going to score here on an air. The throw goes off the helmet of Lauren Bethia. She gets the second on the air. The run scores. Beacon's ahead 5-2. to two. Sophie Richland, her first collegiate RBI, a single up the middle, makes it 6-2 to two, UMass Boston. And then look at this play in the sixth inning by Haley Tilbury. Diving to her right, just near foul territory, to prevent the Royals from getting another run. The Beacons close out a 6-2 victory to start off their day in Myrtle Beach. They will take on Wilson College later on this afternoon in South Carolina.